The main purpose of Dreaming at Will is to provide information that facilitate the reconnection to our all-knowing self. The goal is to let go of the original experiences that still tie us to misconceptions and fears which are embedded in our mind and emotions. Beliefs and emotions affect our bodies and everything else. For this demanding task, we need to first acknowledge the relation we have to many concepts and sentiments, and second, find what tools are appropriate to release our negative or limiting attachments in order to vibrate at the level of our all-knowing self. The caterpillar is a good image to show the transformation of the lower self on Earth, blossoming into its full self and gaining a better overview to accomplish our mission one step at a time. One, if not the best of all questions, is what belief do I need to change? Let us look at one example. My dream work made it clear that we incarnate in order to grow and change wrong beliefs. So I regularly ask this question. The dream was a simple image. I see a nest made of twigs which I realize are dead wood. Two birds' eggs are inside. I assumed it meant I don't believe I can make people receptive to my creative work, that is my dream work, and this is a source of inner conflict. In the second part of the dream, I notice that all objects are earth brown. I think I'm told that I should fully express my ideas though. Finally, I see that the same image reappears, but this time in yellow, meaning more awareness to all will follow, I suppose, when I take action. Those were my first thoughts. Later, I had additional insights. Although I do not acknowledge it, my two selves are preparing to materialize their union, that is, to become aware. My third conclusion was, it feels like a dead end, but I can make money out of my two dream publications. Material gain is possible, and I better know it. The problem is that I ended up with too many explanations, so I decided to look for the meaning closest to the truth with this question. What interpretation in my belief dream is best? The first scene is joyful. I am happy because I passed all subjects of an exam. The message is clear. All interpretations are good. The dream adds, my French grade is only 14 on 20. I feel disappointed. I am surprised a foreign system is used for an American test. This information is suggesting that my ability to create a change in order to assert my authority is linked to people under-evaluating my qualifications in the past. If I confront the issue, I can nullify my inner conflict and show new ways. To reach every corner of your personality, question the seven fundamental topics already named in Journey via Dream at Will, and make your own list of life issues as well. Seek a dream to see what they mean to you. You are likely to come across past lives when you deal with those attributes. Symbols of former incarnations are displayed in the spirituality section. Because thoughts and emotions are always tied together, requesting to feel any of them is another way to sort out the good from the bad. For instance, I want to feel the energy of renewal, or of love, or of truth, in fact of anything. You will recognize the energy in the daytime when you experience it or when you are about to take a decision. Always keep in mind how does one go from destructive tendencies back to innocence? There are four ways of creating a change with the assistance of dreams. One, incubate the issues revealing fear, negativity, evil, falsehood, etc. until they are fully understood. Two, ask for the best solution on your list of possibilities. 
to name a few, one religion or another. A sport, a mind-body technique, a mainstream medical treatment, a relaxing vacation in the Dominican Republic, learning a new language or calligraphy. 3. In the daytime, talk to the negative pattern when it manifests. Tell yourself, I am repeating my old behavior or turn to a dream to find the saying which resonates in you. 4. Consult a dream to obtain the meditation symbol necessary at the moment. No need to focus on a specific matter because the dream mind knows your problems and remedies. I mentioned earlier that answers to yes and no questions are easier to comprehend, although limited in use. But how does the dreamer recognize a yes or no answer? Yes is expressed with symbols of connection. The most obvious images of connection are mail, greetings, radio, movies, television, the alphabet. This M says, yes, you ought to take responsibility, but do so in a new form. Hugging, kissing and lovemaking are also yes signs, but it has in all cases to be enjoyable. Warmth and sunny weather means yes, it is right. The color white tells the light is the source of guidance, therefore yes, the ID in question is good. The movement up, whether on a mountain, steps or standing on a higher level, are all expression of a happy outcome. Celebrations, gatherings, joy, all signify yes. A good laugh plus gold says great thinking. Now, yes to a negative but necessary experience would be an unpleasant plus a connection symbol together, like receiving a rotten fruit as a present. Let us see a demonstration. The question was, is a pendulum the best clairvoyant tool for Laura? Laura was on painkillers due to arthritis. It blocked her ability to do dream work in order to find the source of her disease. I thought that a pendulum might be a good substitute. The dream shows Brad Pitt kissing the naked body of Angelina Jolie. My interpretation is, yes, the pendulum is the right instrument of communication with her angel self, as the initial BP, the French word for P.O. box, plus the kissing suggest. It will allow her to discover the link between her last life and the actual condition of her body. A no answer is illustrated with symbols of separation. The back view of a person wearing black is one example. Loneliness and darkness are also a no reply. White in the midst of black stands for hope in a difficult situation. A disconnected black phone indicates that the contact with the true self is dysfunctional. Cold weather means out of touch with reality. Evidence of error, like the sign X, is a no for answer. So does any representation of death, like a skull or an outline drawing. They all point out to a lack of alignment with the higher self. No to a positive desire, let us say finding love, would combine connection and separation images, like the heart of love flying away.